remember when you had a party and you couldn't clean up the next day and you heard the doors of your parents' car shut? There was a moment of sheer terror followed by a moment of almost immediate acceptance. We're caught. We're done. Then you just started worrying about what was it going to be? A grounding? Who knows? Maybe they had fun on their trip. Maybe they'd be lenient. But after that moment of sheer terror, you were like, you looked around at the house and you knew it was so bad that it wasn't one or two things you could grab. There was so much shit. They're, they knew what was happening. They're, they're going to get you. And you just had to kind of release yourself and go, hey, man, sorry, we had a party. That's what you're going to have to tell your children. We had a party for 50 years. We did it on cheap credit. Uh, we did it by going all around, uh, all over the world and uh, doing things we should not have been doing. Bad, bad things. We had a 50-year party. We bought homes and cars and we mortgaged them and we put them on credit cards and we took out lines of credit. We took out big mortgages. We built big, beautiful cities and then stopped giving a shit about them. And we, we financed this uh, with uh, expansion, uh, you know, uh, that was, you know, financed by war and deceit and fraud. And then we also, you know, did this on the backs of, of immigrants that we pay slave labor to. And we did a lot of bad things. And there were good things that came with that, sure. But we've had a party. We had a big party. And the party was fun. And the music of the party was fun. And the music well, now the music's not too fun at the party anymore because everybody, nobody can sing anymore. You turn on the music and everybody's like, la, 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 la. help me, help me. And you go, this isn't, this isn't that fun anymore. And you used to be able to turn on the TV at the party and see some fun stuff and chuckle and go, <laughs> but you can't because you turn on the TV and it's Chelsea Handler going, you're white, you're white. So that's not fun anymore either. And the party itself is starting to feel not too fun anymore. But then there are people at the party that are going, we can keep the party going if you come into this room. And you go, what's in this room? And you go, well, there's a million words you can't say and you can't look at each other and you can't have any feelings, thoughts, or expressions. And here's a little chip and we're putting it in your ass. And do you have coronavirus? And put on your mask and don't speak. And if you have a business, you can't run it. Stand in the corner and look at the fucking floor. And, there, and there's other people that are going, well, we can keep the party going too, but you got to come in this room. And what? And I go, what do you do in this room? We just jump around without the music. Music and we and if you say there is no music, we kill you. We just say the party's going and it's fun. And then you go, well, if I point out that the food sucks and there's no music, then we say, no, dummy, did you read Q? There isn't supposed to be music at this party. Music's the devil. And you go, what? What about food? And you go, you don't need any fucking food. Q provides you all the nutrition you need. And you go, so I have a choice between one or two of these rooms. Or you could just sit in the living room and wait for the parents. And you know who the parents are going to be? President Z and China. And when they open that fucking door and they say, we're here, you're going to say, mommy and daddy, I love you. I'm so fucking sorry. I could have gone went in one of these rooms with the crazy people, but I decided to sit here and stay here and wait for you. I'm so sorry. The kids from school brought people I didn't know. Oh, and they started drinking and smoking and throwing lamps and they started buying houses and cars and going to war with other houses and I didn't consent to any of that I just listened to music I was just trying to get my dick sucked in the closet I'm trans by the way <laughs> and then mommy and daddy we didn't know we didn't know and then mommy and daddy are going to say something in Chinese and then they're going to zap you and you're going to fall to the floor and they're going to give you a social credit score and you're going to say well it is what it is folks because the party's Fuck it over.